Are you currently having problems with your Hyundai Blue Link app not working and you want to be able to fix this? Well then in this video I'm going to show you a complete step-by-step -step guide on how to fix that specific issue. So what you're going to do firstly is to just close your Hyundai app and instead we're going to go into our settings app. So open up your settings app and now you should be taken to this page right here as you can see. And now what you're going to do on this page is to just simply scroll down a little bit until you can see where it says general. So click on general in here and it should now take you to this page. So what you're going to do on this page is to just scroll down a little bit and then you're going to click where it says iPhone storage as you can see or storage it might just say for you. So I'm just going to click here and I'm going to wait for this to load and perfectly as you can see we should now be taken here. Now I'm just going to scroll down and see if I can find the Hyundai Blue Link app in here. So just a second, it might be somewhere down here actually. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, I might actually have scrolled past it, I'm sorry guys. I'm just going to scroll all the way up here again. Let's see if we can actually, oh, here it is, sorry. Blue link app in here, as you can see, perfectly. As you can see, I'm now going to click on upload app in here, and then I'm going to click on upload app once again. And we're just going to wait, and then I'm going to click on the blue button here again, and then I need to wait for the app to basically update to the latest version. So I had the exact same problem myself before, and I did this step-by-step -step guide on exactly like how to update the app. So this will auto update your app and it should fix all of the bugs that was in the previous version. Because sometimes when there is a new update, for some reason Hyundai Blue Link app just stops working on the old one. And this should fix this issue for you, hopefully. If it still is not working, you can always do like this. Just scroll down to this page right here, enable your air airplane mode and then quickly just disable it afterwards. What will happen is that if you were previously connected to Wi-Fi before, it will now re-establish the connection to a much stronger one basically. And if you're using mobile data, it's going to be the exact same thing basically. It's going to find the new connection, it's going to be a bit stronger and then hopefully you will now be able to actually fix this issue as well.